Okay, uh, welcome to the part 3 of uh, Assembly 886 tutorial. Uh, we want to continue talking about registers. Uh, so let me just pick a new color. Here, let's choose red. Okay. Uh, we talk about uh, the accumulator, the base register, the count register, for, which is a counter for loops and shift, the data register. And uh, we want to illustrate the, the relation between the data register and the segment registers. So what is the relation between segment register and the other registers, which is pointer and index register and the general purpose register. And I want to ignore the flag register right now. Okay. Uh, okay. Especially we want to talk about the base uh, the SP, the base, source, destination, and the instruction pointer. Okay, um, so the first thing uh, we want to take is the CS, which is the code segment. And you know, you need to know that code segment is related to the IP. So there's a relation here between CS and between the, uh, the IP. Okay, uh, this is the first uh, the first part CS and IP. Uh, next, so we end up with the CS. Next, we move to the DS, which is the data segment, and uh, we move to the CSS and ES. But it's more precise to begin with SS with the DS. I'm sorry, DS is the data segment. And data segment is related to uh, the BX is related to three registers. DS is related to the first one is PX. Here we go, PX, and to DI and SI, and also to DI and SI. So. DS is with SI, which is source index for string and destination index for uh, string also, and the BX, which is the base pointer or the pointer to the base address, which is the data. So when you're talking about data, we're talking about a base address, you're talking about data, and the data might be string. So you should notice that here we have a string and here we have a string. And here also we have a string. We have data. So you should uh, you should know how to distinguish between PX and PB because PB is for the stack, which is the base of index or the base address of a stack. So uh, the base uh, the the base or the pointer to the base address, the data and the source index and the destination index is related to the data segment. So after the data segment we want to move to the stack segment. Here we go, the stack segment. And the stack segment is very important. Okay, uh, the stack segment, it's, it's clearly, it's clear that stack segment is for stack. So uh, basically, stack segment is related to the stack pointer and the base pointer for the top of the stack, for the base of the stack. So SS will be for these two. Okay, uh, let me make it more cleaner. Uh, last one is ES, and ES is for extended data segment extended data segment so it's for DI okay so here we end up with uh, the explanation of registers what is each register relate to and the next video I want to introduce to you other uh, or le let me say other example on how to calculate how to relate the segment register with the other kind of register which is
pointer and index register and might be a general register or even might be a instruction pointer so see you next time in other the next tutorial thank you